In this video, we're going to take a look at one exponential growth problem in which the population doubles in size. So right there is telling us the population doubles. All right, the other thing that you need to be aware of is that it is growing continuously. So for that reason, we need to make sure that we are using the appropriate formula. This is the formula for when a population is growing continuously. All right, basically, P sub zero means the initial population value. All right, the value for E, E will always be in the problem. All right, raised to the rate times the time. All right, when this is worked out, if you were trying to find the end population, then that would be P of T, okay? If um, in this case it says how long would it take, so we're trying to solve for T, so we'll fill in all the other values. Um, you could have to solve for R, okay? Anytime you're given a formula, you plug in from the story problem what you have and then you solve for the unknown. All right, so let's take a look at this. It says, suppose a certain population is growing continuously at a rate of 3% per year. All right, so they've given us R, they've given us the rate. All right, how long? All right, that's T, I'm trying to solve for T. Would it take for the population to double in size? All right, so at no point in time did they tell us the initial amount of the population, but they're telling us it doubles. All right, in which case then Let's just pick some really small numbers to make the math easy. And let's assume our population is one initially to start with. All right, well, if it doubles in size, one doubled would be two. All right, since they didn't give us an initial population, I can choose to do it like this. Pick two numbers where the relationship between them is doubled. All right, then I'm gonna have the E, which is always in the problem. All right, they gave me the percent or the rate, so 0.03, I'm trying to solve for T. All right, so we've got two equals one times E raised to the 0.03 T. All right, this is an exponential equation. To solve exponential equations, your first step is to take the natural log of both sides. So we're going to take the natural log of both sides. Okay, so I'm going to have the natural log of two is equal to the natural log of e raised to the point o three t. All right, now from um, your basic principles of logarithms, all right, this is natural log of e raised to an exponent. The base on that natural log is an E, matches the base here. So I'm hoping that this, you automatically know, is just going to be 0.03T. All right, in which case I can then write natural log of 2 is equal to 0.03T. If I'm trying to solve for T, I'm going to divide both sides by that 0.03. So divide by 0.03, divide by 0.03. Those will cross out, all right? Now, you could leave um, your time in terms of a natural log answer. So t equals natural log of 2 over 0.03, all right? Or you could get a calculator, plug this in, natural log of 2 over 0.03, and get the decimal approximation, which is going to be 23.10 years. So pretty straightforward, all right? You do have to have this continuous compounding formula memorized, all right? Um, and since the population is doubling, the easiest thing, since they didn't give you an exact amount for the population, just put in a one and a two, because that clearly has been doubled, all right? And then from here to here, having those natural logarithm uh, properties memorized so that you realize that you can real easily solve this and it's just 0.03t is your next main point here. So definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.